Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's OK Ma, we're back with another episode of The Last Spell. The goal today is to knock out a couple more days here in Gildenburg. We'll see how far we get. Um, so let's go ahead and just load her on up. OK, we're now in game. Um, we did finish the previous production phase and we are ready to kickstart this episode. So I'm just going to go ahead and end phase right now and end phase yet again. All right, who to start off with? So we have some guys way up north. Oh my god, they're coming from all the way down there, too. All right, so we'll use Claire first. Move her up here. Ooh, good damage. Move you here. She can move up to about there. And this move is about three tiles away. I haven't used it yet. Okie dokie, pretty good damage. I'm gonna probably, or I'm gonna, what is that move? Wind walk on her. Have her move away. Undo that. No, no, you can go here, actually. Buff up. Buff this guy up. Uh, anyway. Pop evasion, and then we can start attacking a couple people. You need to move so you don't get attacked. You can go up three steps. And what we'll do is attack this guy twice. Oh, he dead. Do that again. Oh, one more time, maybe. And you're good where you're at. Okay, we'll end phase here. Uh, poison him. Oh, this guy needs to be poisoned, too. Uh, two rounds of poison. Not gonna kill him. That won't kill him either. Interesting. Okay, he's definitely gonna die now. Hope you here. He's dead. And it even shows that his movement isn't gonna be applied in this in this round either. Oops, actually undo that. Oh, this lady here is moving pretty quickly. Can't hit her though. Undo your movement, go here instead. This guy will try to propagate. Not bad, not bad. Still not doing very good damage. We need to move him. I could attack more with him, but we're going to pass. Let them accumulate a few more enemies before we try to uh, multi-damage or multi-attacks. All right, go here. I think it's this one. Move again. Nice. Do it again. He's down. You need to move back here and attack this person, actually. Coming out of nowhere. One more hit, maybe? She's out of turns. This dude here, move him back. He is surrounded by people. That guy's dead. All right, we're good. We're good. Good. Uh, she's going to try to handle the folks over here. He's going to handle the guys in the middle, and he's going to do the best he can to hold his own.
Alrighty then. Um, I'm probably gonna poison this guy up, so we did last time. We're gonna propagate first. Nice. Poison twice. Okay, he can't move anymore. Get him out of range so he doesn't get attacked. <clears throat> move him here. Attack everybody. Go forward. Free hit. All right, moving on to the next person. Okay, she can attack one more person. He can armor up. You can't do anything. Enter. That was a big hit. I didn't think that guy could reach me. Ooh, that guy's strong. Okay, he's gonna be dead. He's gonna be dead. I'm gonna propagate. Do some extra damage. Propagate again. This guy here can't do nothing. Move back. Let's hit this again. Right there. And then we need to fall back. Now she is going to move over here to help take care of these guys. Beautiful. That helps out a lot. She's not going to get hit from here. We're going to armor her up, though. He can't armor up. He's fully spent. These two guys are going to die. Uh, they will be able to damage my structures because they can move or she can move a little bit further but that's as much as we can do right now we're gonna do next poison him twice just like we did last time Then propagate right there. Good stuff. This guy, he can get hit everywhere. That's not good. How about now? He should be in the clear now. Can I reach with another skill? Nice. Nice and dead. Moving on to the next person. Uh, this is going to be a perfect opportunity for me to use the... Uh, whatever the skill is called. Hammer of Faith. That should hit one, two, three enemies. Good damage. Oh, hit... Another one. Cool. Ooh, that's not going to help, is it? Move her away. This guy can't do anything. This dude's spent. They're going to do some damage to the walls again. Uh, 
Okay, from here, move you. Four. This guy's still alive, but he, he can only do the damage there. Hopefully that kills. Did not. What else do you have? Number three? Oh, sorry. Number eight. Uh, that'll kill both of them. Please hit both. I doubt it. They have to be adjacent. Yeah. I keep on forgetting about this free hit. Now, this guy here has got a lot of problems. A lot. Those two are dead. This guy can't move. That guy can move. Maybe try some propagation. And then poison. So now he can't move hardly. Move again. Right there. Okay, let me try it again. Oh, I can't. I don't have enough movement points. What about this? How does this work? Out of range. Targets yourself. Oh. Okay. Let's try it out. So targets yourself. Oh, that's cool. Cost two mana. Perfect. Nobody can hit the walls. Oh, yeah, that's good. End turn. Let's do it again. I'm going to kill this guy, and then... Oh, my God. This is going to be awesome. Go here. Whirlwind. Oh, my God. That's so cool. Go in here, we're gonna do the uh propagation. Click, click. He's dead. She should be fine by herself. Then hit him with this. Oh, yeah. Can we do it again? Oh, we're out of energy. Okay. Move here. And turn. Same idea. Out of range. I don't think I'd be able to kill this guy. No. Actually, yes. Noisely done. Let's get the animations. We have an S rating followed by another S rating. So this realm, we're definitely going to want to purchase a brand new hero, put three here, probably one over there. Have like a floater in between right in the middle. Let's see what we got here. Um, scavenger camp, get that sucker unlocked with the armor maker, weapons production, blacksmith, the boyer, and the magic shop. I don't think we have enough room to build all of these. We may as well unlock the armor maker. What sort of achievements did we unlock? Rejoice, O Earth and Sea, for I have come with gifts in hand. When will it all end? 
This depends on thy grasp of the cosmos. One would say, never. But if thou thinkest only about the very orb thou art now inhabiting, one can reach some kind of closure, at least as mortals see it. Let us partake in this glorious endless cycle of life and death. Escape oblivion. Um. Oh, we received this one here. Affects the caster. So buff increases the in attribute for a given duration. And this one here is Gladiator Greaves dodge, reliability, accuracy, uh, dodge, resistances, move, reliability, accuracy, effects of dodge. Okay. Time to level up. Actually, before we level up, let's look at an item. What did we get? Oh, there's a hammer. I'm kind of digging the axes right now. Let's not do the hammer. Let's go ahead and keep the axes. Stun chance. Let's grab this one up. 28 extra armor. I'm going to level this up. Extra production. It's maxed out. Good stuff. So we have 249 gold. We definitely need a brand new character. So go to the inn. Who do we have to pick from? Eight physical, eight magic. Negative 10 health regen. Dodge and negative armor. Uh, Azia is a... Oh my god. Ma uh, magic damage, mana. Mana? Mana? Okay. She's like... Not terrible. She's only level one, but she is a magic user. If I ever did see one, I could recruit her for 50. Who cares if she's level one? She'll figure it out. Okay, for Claire, I'm thinking of a couple of things for the future, right? We've got vampires. So whenever the enemy is killed with physical damage or execute, boom, we gain health. Uh, currently restoring four health. Because I was thinking, grab this one up alongside blood magic. Uh, all of the hero's mana is transformed into resistance. Conversion rate is at 25%. We get 13 resistances and plus 12 daily uh, mana regen. So if I stack uh, extra armor, extra health. So armor, health, and mana. All of those would be good things for us. Let's do blood magic to kickstart it. Reroll. More mana, that's going to help us. Because we don't actually have mana, but look over to my perks. It increases our resistances. Stun, critical, damage, opportune. Uh, max daily health, because we're going to be using our health quite a bit, so may as well increase it. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and grab up Lone Wolf. Go ahead and increase it by another eight. Why not? Uh, the range damage or poison damage increase. The poison's been doing fairly well. Sure, let's increase it. Propagation, it'll bounce three more times, and for every eight enemies killed, we'll lose one pro uh, propagation bonus, but gain more propagation damage. Uh, two range? Yes, actually, let's do that one, and then we'll go for quanti qual quantity versus quality. Level up. More mana. Certainly. Stun chance? Um, you know what? She does stun a lot with the this move here. And that's everybody leveled up. So back to construction. We do have to repair some uh, fortifications. Repair that one. And that's it. I do want to craft up, however. Go to defenses. I'm going to put one of these down. So that way, when this person is uh, guarding, they're going to have a little bit additional assistance from the catapult. We're going to put up a door, a wooden gate, right here, and here. I should have put one a little bit further away. Take a look inside of the shop. We do have this armor. I have to use that up real quick. Find out who needs it. I'm assuming you would be the best fit for it. Block, daily health regen. Yes, the health regen. We already talked about that being a factor. Sell this off. The the grape shot, probably can't use it. We don't have a gun user just yet. Ooh, 39 armor for 30. Mana and mana regen. This is an offhand book. Compare her books. This is a little bit better for 20. 
All right, so go to our melee user, which is this guy. Slap that on. We get to sell this. Go ahead and put that for her. That's plus 10 daily. So we get 60 or sorry, 84 max with 10 regen every single turn. A little bit better. Then we can sell that off. And back to building more fortifications. I'm going to put another, another one of these down. Followed by a, uh, a door. Put a door here. And a wall right next to it. Okay, next is to kind of get our, our mana taken care of. So I'm going to level this up. Upgrade. Upgrade and upgrade. Restore. Restore everybody's. Beautiful stuff. We got three more people we can use. We may as well uh, increase our gold reserves. Now we can have uses per phase. Uh, you know, I don't really need to increase the uses per phase. We've already used up everybody. I have these dead bodies I forgot to take care of. Um, again, taking care of those does have an achievement associated to it. So we'll have to keep that in mind. I want to destroy this building too. The temple. Let's do the scavengers camp right about here. And maybe another one right about there. So this will help us with daily uh, construction abilities, right? Can't do anything with it just yet. So we're going to go ahead and end phase. It's now time to move our people around. I am going to put you right here. Archer all the way over here. He's going to have this health, uh, the ballista to help protect them too. You're going to be right there. And I think she's going to be a floater. Maybe something like that. That should be fine. Okay, end phase. Oh, fantastic! It just shoots by itself. That's a free hit. Let's go! Uh, starting off, go ahead, propagate. We'd love to see that damage. Uh, this guy moves a lot, so we're going to poison him. Well, he's going to be dead, so... <laughs> click, click. Click, click. There we go. Nobody can touch him. You are fresh. I don't even know what our abilities do. We have the shadow bolts. She's got so much range. Oh my goodness. A weakening touch. Weakening touch chains a wait chains a portion of damage as well as a uh, potential negative alteration applied by the skill to a random adjacent uh, unit up to up to max bounces. Uh, bounces six. Okay. Oh, here's the resistances: negative thirty and negative thirty damage for two turns. Then there's fireball. Which should hit, oh my goodness, what? And then this lightning strike. Oh, we've used lightning strike before. She uses a lot of mana, she's got 57. In the future, we're gonna have to increase her mana reserves even further. Oh my god. Fireball? Oh, that is so cool. Um, We've already came to the conclusion that uh, this does propagate I should have used I can't use it there I'm gonna try to propagate it it's only a debuff interesting but it it moves on everybody so that's cool all right well she can get hit so fall back there we go um from here this is uh just this guy by himself really Huh? Why are you still alive? I want to move her a little bit closer. Give some more movement. Put him right there. Hit for free. One more time. Move her back. 
and then slap on the armor. Do the same thing for him. She's completely spent and do the evasion. And third. I love the fact that I get a free hit. That that's freaking awesome. Propagate again. May as well do it one more time. Okay, I'm gonna poison this guy. So he's gonna be basically dead. He can't move hardly at all. You on the other hand. Big fireball. Love to see it. And then lightning bolt. That should chain. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so good. Um and she's only level one. Ridiculous. Get her closer. Ooh, and they're stunned, except for this guy. So I won't worry about the rest of them. I want to move her to this position. Give her a little bit more movement. Move her up. Nobody can hit her. And then we're just going to wait it out. Buff. She can't buff no more. Oh, sorry. There we go. She doesn't. She, yeah, she's already used all hers, so she can't buff, and he's used all of his. Okay. So the big dude's dead. He's not going to survive for much longer. But she needs to do a big AoE, so I'm going to do number six. Spread that lightning around. Fireball. And he needs to poison some folks. So that guy looks like he can be poisoned. Who else should I poison? He's dead, so he's, he's out of the question. He's dead, too. Good crits. One more time. And fall back. Uh, you may as well just armor up. And then figure out where to go. Here? That's fine with me. This guy. Go to the middle. Use this fantastic AoE. Ho, 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 ho. She could use a free hit, number four. Dude, strong! No way! Did we one-tap him? Ridiculous. I think it's now time I probably bring this dude over to help out. I'm gonna bring him here, move her over. Give him an additional buff. Move him around. There we go. You, on the other hand. Here. Out of range. There. Dead. Get wrecked. Propagate. Okay, so we have stun, stun, stun. This guy's by himself. She's perfect. Oh, we're going to hit another lightning bolt. Good hits. Yeah. 
Elusiveness. More armor. Make sure she can't get hit. He's all out of points. He can't do anything further. And you've already done everything. There we go. We're going to take out those two dudes just by poisoning them. He's out of points. Oh boy. Son of a gun. <sighs> Go figure, didn't die. Guess we just decrease everybody's attacks. That's about as much as I can do there. She needs to fall back. He's in the thick of it. Go through the door. Oh my God. Out of range. I think she's fine as is. I'm going to start moving her over here because I think there's only one more a uh, couple people coming from the the south over on this side. And turn. Yeah, her section's fine. He's going to take some damage. Ultimately, everything can be repaired, so that's good. Uh, let me think about how to do this. Propagate. One more free hit. So now he's dead. Let's get out of here. This dude, spend it. I hate using it right there, though. He's just not that strong. She's going to need so much mana after this. Holy cow. Oh, dang. He can't go nowhere. Oh, no. What are you going to do? You're you're done. Oh, my God. He's going to get hit by so many people. Well, maybe three at most. <laughs> oh, goodness. Um, shoots and ladders. Uh... Nice hit. And now you just need to run the frick away. That's about as much as we can do. Things are going to take hits. People are going to die. He took a little bit of a health damage. Not too crazy. You need to come around. He's going to die, like, regardless.
Come on. You can die. One more hit. And then we'll, we'll throw some lightning at somebody. This is the last thing she can use. Fall back. You, my friend. Kill this guy, kill that guy. Uh, go ahead. Pop that. Pop this. Propagate some damage. And then do it again. Fall back! And turn. Alright, we lost one of the uh, one of the walls, which is fine. Click, click. Move you forward. Before I kill that thing, before I kill that thing. I want everybody to use <laughs> their buffs. Okay, so we lost a couple walls. I don't know between the HP loss that we've taken if it's going to be good for us. I'm going to get a... Just got an S rating. Cool. Three and three? There, nah, you're ridiculous. Am I too strong? Do I have too much gold? Is that what the problem is? Okie dokie. Armor maker. Check. Well, more better defenses. 477 left. Mounted ballistas. <gasps> it can go on top of the... Okay, yeah! I like that idea. Put them on top of my fortifications. Uh, spiked sets. Uh, resistances. Block. Damage. Minus critical. Plus accuracy. Uh, less movement on this one. Those are fancy. I like that. What sort of weapon are we going to get ourselves today? We have a sword. We have a hammer. And we have these pants with dodge. Plus 8 mana, plus 25 health. Let's do this one. As mentioned before, we're going to do the propagation. Slap that. Train. Level up. She's going to need, again, more mana regen. There's extra mana. I guess. No. I'm trying to go for mana regen. Probably not going to get it, am I? Got more mana. Okay. Isolation. Isolated targets. Okay. We'll do this one. All right. Let's see what she's going to be good for. Uh, extra mana? Absolutely. You don't have enough right now. Yeah, let's do that one. Oh, you have more perks because you leveled up a couple times. Ooh, magic fuel to give us more weapon damage? Armor to 40? So if she does take hits, she's going to be pretty well off. Free armor is free armor. Extra damage in the blue? Got it. Daily mana regen? Check. Uh, reorganize. Daily mana regen to 12? You're going to be spending mana like a sieve, so yeah, let's go for it. This is our... Oh, right, we're going to do vampiric. So every time we kill somebody... What's that one do? Every 5% missing health, you do more crit. Uh, that would make kind of sense. Every 5% if we're, if we're utilizing um, blood magic. So I'll probably grab that. What's this one do? Every four enemies killed gives us more daily health regen. 20% of the... Oh my god. All three of these. We're going to be blood heroes. Let's do the health regen first. Worry about crit later. And then we have organic armor. 50% healing received. I wonder if that increases the healing received from vampiric. Uh, all of the hero's armor is transformed into health. I'd gain another 100 health. That's a scary thought. All right, anyway, <laughs> let's go ahead and level up. More health. More mana. Mana, again, because of our perk. Mana does what again? 
resistances and daily health regen. Uh, giving us more overall health is nice as well. Then we have daily mana regen. I don't think the daily mana... Re what does the daily mana regen do for us? Daily mana regen and the daily health. Okay, let me just refresh. See if we get lucky. Healing received. Multiply or apply to any kind of health restored to this healer. So vampiric should be a part of this. I do believe. Let's refresh one more time. Hopefully... We get lucky and we didn't. <laughs> Experience. We level up more, we can get more skills. On to construction. I need to repair a bunch of walls. And then we need to craft some defenses. So 30. I obviously need to craft up another mana well. I'll put it right here. And we'll level it up. This lady here definitely needs more mana. But she's so strong. I guess I'm going to use it again. She's still not maxed out. Ugh. Okay, no worries. No worries. Uh, we we'll go into the shop. Let's see what sort of upgrades we can grab up. Ooh, a Scepter 3. 72. We'll take it. Two mana is not bad. This one uses five. Two mana seems appropriate. Grab that, grab this. How much gold? 27? Fantastic. Now, I don't imagine her taking any damage. Uh, she, can, she can stay pretty far away. Effects, 75 additional armor when you use Brace. That's insane. Here's a nice upgrade. Let me compare these two. Uh, this one gave us daily health regen and block. This one gives me more health, negative move, but extra armor from brace. Compare these two together. I get more health, more move. Hey, it offsets that move. That's pretty good. Plus more accuracy. Let's grab it up. I'll slap these on somebody else. You do pretty good. So you're going to need more mana. Look at that. So much mana. Um... Sell that off. Let's give it to her. There we go. 91 total mana. He can use one. Just put it on him. Uh, lastly, armor, block, daily health. And then we'll uh, use a worker. Use a worker. And lastly, just double check in my character screens. Slap that. Oop. Yeah, yeah, he's the one with the shield. So it's resistance is armor and extra damage for block. Good deal. Um, Figure out who to put where. Why are those three giant blocks of health, whereas this one has a bunch of small blocks? How does that work? <laughs> you have 183. This one's got 304. Confused how that works, but all right. Uh, so two ballistics. I hate splitting these people up when there's literally a three skull and a three skull. This is going to be horrible. <laughs> I'm not going to like this at all. Um, all right. Wish me luck. Can I build something more? The scavengers? I may as well. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and end phase. There's nothing else I can do right now. Uh, end phase again. Good damage. Okay damage. Starting us off. So she's got 88 mana. She's got quite a few skills in her arsenal. Move over. Do some propagation. Alright, the two that are stunned, I won't worry about doing any additional damage to. Move her to here. You have to do something to somebody. Uh, number three. You got eight HP off of that for killing. 
It's a pretty good trade-off. They got a heck of a lot of movement, though. If I put him here, he should be fine. Armor up. Can you armor up? You sure can. This side didn't start off too bad, but I do see an archer in the back. So I'm going to start off with you. We're going to take these two shield boys out with poison. So poison him. Poison him. Attack the two in the front. Uh, line of sight because of the shield guy. That's fine. Step back. And then... Again, I can't hit anybody in the back, so we may as well just take out the front, the front row. And I'm happy with that. End turn. Oh, one of them already got into my base. What the heck? How are you there? Where did this one even come from? Sixteen health off of that kill. Eight health off of that one. <laughs> I'm liking this vampiric thing. Let's go. Now she needs to kill this thing. Nice. Give her a little bit more movement. Uh, have her go forward. Who has more? This guy's got a lot of movement. What? Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Actually, go here. So they can't do anything further. On this side of the aisle, we have more shielders, so it's the same idea. I'm gonna poison him. Poison that one. So now their movements are significantly reduced. Uh, propagation over here. Oh boy. I forget these guys have a lot of HP. Ugh, I don't like that. Okay, I kind of screwed up. I should have uh, focused on those two archers. Fall back. The archer's got a heck of a lot of range. Uh, for her, number six seems like a pretty good idea. Or sorry, number four. Good job. I was gonna kill them off the bat. I probably should have just used it on somebody else. Oh, she's completely spent. Uh, fall back. You can fall back even more. I'm worried about these archers. End turn. Oh my god, there's like 600 archers over here. Wait a minute. How could he could take a hit? I swear nobody was supposed to take a hit. What? How did you even take damage? I'm confused. God dang, this guy, you can't hit him. I need to move, you can move up one, move him here. Okay, end turn. I think, did I, did I do anything over here? No, I have not. Don't end turn just yet. This guy's got how much HP? 129. My poison damage does 108. So I'm gonna have to hit both of these guys. And then I can uh, kill these two off. Should I poison? It'll be guaranteed. Oh, that's not poison. Son of a gun. <laughs> I did it wrong. I'll propagate again. Should 
just to make sure he's dead. Over on this side of the aisle. Can she kill them? She can get hit, so she needs to fall back one turn. End turn. Oh my god, so many archers. There's like 20 of them. Miss. <laughs> Look how many enemies are still in the back. This is ridiculous. That did not chain very well. Oh, very good hits. This guy, we're going to slap a uh, poison on him. That that ensures he's going to die next round. Could do it again. And then poison this guy, because that'll ensure he's dead. But this, this guy right here. Can we kill him with one hit? Oh, we cannot kill him with one hit. But it appears I've taken him down to three turns. Right? Yeah, I didn't know that was a thing. So does that is that how that works? No, no, it does not. <laughs> okay, uh, end turn. I think we're good. Maybe? No, we're not. Uh, perfect place to spin the wheel. Nicely done. Number three. Number three again. Ugh. Nice. Archer's got to go. Nice. Okay, good deal. Good deal. Good deal. So she's out of range of everybody, but I have these two that we have to contend with. Um, move over. We'll see what happens. Let's go. Like, they're dead. Good job. That guy can't attack. She can armor up. Oh my god, they're so close. They still miss. She's got good dodge. That might be close to the last. They still got a little bit more enemies coming through. Uh, next round, but this side here is going to be pretty cleared up. So we're going to use right there. Oh my god, it works so well. Do it again. <laughs> so, so many people are stunned. We're going to focus on the ones that are not stunned. Oh, she's already spent. She can stay right where she's at. Uh, This dude... I move forward to we could spend uh, this twice. Good deal. Good deal. So everybody else in the front row is stunned. Fall back. That's beautiful. Uh, head over to this side <laughs> where things aren't looking so good. Uh, let's start off with our with our mage. Try to get as many people dead as possible. Um, that didn't spread as well as I was hoping. She's already spent. This guy here, click, click. Those two are now dead. Uh, poison this guy. Because now he's... Jesus. Uh, he still has a lot of tiles to move. 
All right, so they're gonna do some damage. He can't move no more. He's gonna take a hit probably. Yeah, the rest of them can. Okay, this is this kind of stinks. Um, what does this do? Oh, okay. Yeah, I see. I see. I see. Move here. Interesting way. Oh no, you weren't supposed to move forward. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Move back. Move back. <laughs> Um, does she have anything else? No, she's completely spent. Fall back one more. So you don't take any damage at all, please. Uh, entered. Who's got an action point? Not you, not you. Oh, it was you. Entered. So these two here, just they just can't seem to handle it by themselves. These guys are doing pretty good. Good damage. Nice. She can fall back. This dude here, I don't know. Um, who should I have walk over here and assist? Because uh, one of these y'all can manage this side by themselves. Uh, didn't kill him. Close, but didn't kill him. All right, archers. Let's see what we can do here. Uh, we missed quite a few. Try to spread these lightning bolts around. Oh, that was a pretty big one. It didn't do much damage, however. All right, we're going to try to poison this guy. Hopefully it hits. So now his movement is drastically reduced. We're going to move you here. You still have one more point. Um, try to kill that guy, but he can't. Ensign, who has an action point left? Turn seven. So this side here is pretty much done. Um, I'm going to move. She can definitely make it over there. This guy. We're going to have to hold the fort uh, by ourselves. <laughs> We're going to have to. Um... Let them do that. I'm going to try to take this guy out. Good deal. So he can't move anymore, but... Not bad, not bad. You head over and assist, please. I'll have to waste a couple points. Now from here, who can I hit? Anybody? Still nobody. Waste a couple more points. While I spread the mana. She's got 32 mana left. Um, Hit this guy. Yeah, that hit pretty hard. She's out. Who can you hit? Nobody? 
Move forward. I'm thinking here. Maybe this mana bomb. Nice. Oh, miss. There we go. Who to attack? No. How's that? Oh, let me undo that move. That thing's now poisoned. Uh, we're gonna go ahead, head inside. Yep, that's all the moves we can take. 28 enemies left. That's okay, that door's about to hit, almost had it. Let me think about this, hit, them, hit these guys. Or can they walk? Decrease their damage. Negative damage. Move you over here, do the same dang thing. Spread it around. Decrease everything, please. No line of sight, that sucks. Poison two enemies, he's done. You've got five moves. Go to the door. Hello? Oh, that was a crit. Damage. One more attack. Miss. Oh no! Fart sticks. Uh, she's gonna get hit by somebody. Don't know who, but she's gonna get hit by at least two people. But oh, you can only move once. <laughs> I can't do that. That just just attack this thing. It's dead. Uh, everybody's turns have been used up, right? Yes, yes, they have. That door's probably had it. Nope. I did not mean to do that, but that works out well, yes. I guess we go this side. Hit him with number three. I saw number four. And now he's spent. He can't go anywhere. We have to kill that thing off. But uh, the rest of these guys are going to be dead. He's dead. Don't have to focus on him at all. Woo! Easy game. She can move this way. You can move over here. Give this lady here another move. Give her another move afterward. I figure she has more range. She still can't hit him, though. Okay, uh, end turn. Ten action points. Well, I don't know how who uh, has these action points. But stop it. Get 
breaks the wall a little bit. No worries! We're on our way! Can you hit him? Nope. I can't. <laughs> That's so stupid. Go this way. Uh, oh my god, what are you doing? You're so dumb. And by you, I mean me. Dun dun dun! S rating! Let's go. I lost 106 HP. But, I mean, so we lost it, but we also didn't lose it because we, 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 we have recovered it. You know what I'm saying? Another S rating. 1800. Mm, one. This is going to be the boss, I believe. And if it's the boss, we're saving this for the next episode. But let's do the production, get this taken care of. Tainted Essence. Weapon production. Uh, mounted Ballistas. Uh, I already want to go for this. Proves the selling price. Okay. Uh, yeah. Well, why not? We'll get that unlocked next. What do we unlock? Ooh, the Frost Mage set. Armor, armor, armor. Block, physical damage, and magic. How does that help us for a magic user? Block, mana, negative move, physical mana. Again, we get more block with fortify. This one gives us armor, block mana. Physical and damage, less accuracy. Frost Mage, okay. Let's first grab our nightly reward. We've got a pretty strong tier 4 hammer. Pistol and some greaves. I don't want to switch anybody's weapons around, so I'm not going to take that. Uh, we'll take these this time. Oh, the poison damage. I know who that's going to. Uh, in fact, going to this guy right here. Move those off, move this on. All right, before I put points in him, I figured to look at the shop. I'm going to grab this trinket. I know exactly what we're going to get for him. Uh, Grab up. I think it's... That's equipment. Oh, did I screw this up? I might have. No, one trinket slot. There we go. That's perfect. Also, in the shop, there is an offhand crossbow. Block. Put that away. Grab the offhand crossbow instead. I want that book, too. That should give us a free hit. Multi-hits times two. Plus armor piercing. He's already got massive extra damage at 51%. Resistances, armors at, you know, pretty solid. 59. Let's give him more damage. Daily man is not going to make a difference considering next day is day seven. So reorganize. Experience isn't going to matter. Propagation. Okay. He does propagate. Next level up is on our Aziza. She's got only one level up, one perk to spend. I guess we give her Mark, because I can't see anything else that's worth taking at this uh, stage in the game. Again, she's a wizard, so... Wizardry stuff. Mana. <laughs> that works for me. Um, stun, physical experience, momentum. I don't really have anything <laughs> worth taking. Physical damage is Oh my goodness. Uh, I don't know if she has any stuns, but we'll. I guess we'll grab this just in case. Probably worthless. That's it for uh, level ups. Moving on to the construction phase. Actually, let me go to the shop. Uh, back to the gear. We're obviously going to upgrade that. Sell this off. 
We do have a shield, but nobody to use it with. So sell that. Sell those. 54 armor. We have a helmet with 7 resistance and 6 block. We have this armor with 32. I'm going to grab up the triple swipe scroll. Probably the grape shot. You can do grape shot. I guess. Give it to you. Just in case she gets close enough. Let's grab it. Does this one not have a helmet? No, she does not. 329 HP, recovers 42. And another, grab another hat for somebody, I guess. Better than nothing. I'll sell everything else off. Okay. Building phase. Let's go ahead and get my stuff repaired. Repair. 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 Now we can upgrade these for only 10. So that's fantastic. Upgrade. Um, Wall mounted ballista. Oh, it literally is literally on a wall mounted ballista. And it costs 90. Goodness. Um, I better put it over here. Let me just destroy this wall. We'll build it on this side. Because we have two on a one side. We have one on a singular. So now we have two uh, ballistas. You would think that the range would be further because it's higher up, but whatever. Temple. Oh, uh, to give us some health. And then we need our mana levels back. So use that on her. Oh boy. <laughs> they're, they're, the levels are getting up there. Um, use one more person to recover everybody's HP. And then I probably could have just used this by itself and it would have been fine. You know, actually, let's just do it this way. I'll, I'll break one of these down. 18 gold, 32 materials. And that'll allow me to upgrade another wall. Okie dokie. Um, I think that should do it. I'll probably leave this guy by himself. Uh, the ranger, or sorry, this lady over here alongside my melee character. She can hold the fence by herself. I hope because there's one um, of these uh, catapult things, whatever you want to call them. Cool. Well, that'll end it for today's episode, y'all. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this channel with your friends and family. I'll catch y'all next time. Bye.